Do you know what really happens when you fly? As we jet set across the globe, we often overlook the intricate world of air travel that exists behind the scenes. Each time we buckle up, we're participating in a complex dance of engineering, logistics and human behaviour. But like any dance, there are steps that aren't shown to the audience. Today, we're pulling back the curtain to reveal the hidden truths of air travel. Now you have two options. The first is to press pause, go back to your daily routine and continue in a state of blissful ignorance. You can carry on believing that your flight is just a simple hop from point A to point B and that the duct tape you saw on the wing was part of a well-planned maintenance routine. Or you can choose the second option to venture into the unknown and discover the realities of what happens miles above the earth. Yes, it might be a little unnerving. Yes, it might disrupt the tranquility of your next flight. But knowledge is power and understanding these secrets can give you a new perspective on your journey. From the surprising items people steal on board, to the number of screws a plane can legally fly without, to the unsettling truth about in-flight blankets and headphones, we're going to cover it all. We will delve into the details of what happens when a bomb threat occurs mid-flight, why your tray table might not be as clean as you think, and why pilots are served different meals. We'll also explore the ins and outs of airline employee payment, the shocking realities of plane water, and what really happens if you use the oxygen bags for more than 15 minutes. And if you're wondering why the walkways are lit, we'll shed light on that too. So, are you ready? It's time to fasten your seatbelt and secure your tray table. Brace yourself as we dive into the secrets airlines don't want you to know. You might have never thought about this, but people steal the underseat life jackets. An odd fact, isn't it? Yet it's a reality. Some passengers, perhaps driven by a peculiar sense of souvenir collecting, pilfer these life-saving devices. This theft can leave the next passenger without this crucial aid in case of an emergency. A slightly unsettling revelation, isn't it? Well, hold on to your seatbelts because we're just getting started. Next, let's talk about those tiny screws that hold the plane together. Yes, the ones you've probably never given a second thought to. Brace yourself for this. There are guidelines about the number of screws a plane can fly without. While it's a safety measure to account for possible wear and tear, knowing that your plane could be missing a screw or two is not exactly comforting, is it? Now let's shift our attention to the cabin crew, the friendly faces that serve you in-flight meals and ensure your comfort. Did you know that some of them don't get paid until the plane is airborne? Yes, all the pre-flight preparations, boarding assistance and safety demonstrations are unpaid labour for some airline employees. Ready for another gulp of truth? The water on the plane, it's not as clean as you might think. Reports suggest it could be teeming with bacteria, and yes, even faecal matter. This is why you often hear the advice to avoid drinking coffee or tea on board, as they're typically made with this water. Finally, let's talk about the oxygen bags. In case of a drop in cabin pressure, these bags can be a lifeline. But if you're using them for more than 15 minutes, things are not looking good. The supply in these bags typically lasts only around 15 minutes, enough time for the pilot to descend to a safer altitude where you can breathe normally. And that's just the beginning. Let's delve deeper. Even the headphones in wrappers have probably been used before. Can you believe it? Those seemingly fresh headphones that come in a neat little plastic bag? Yes, those have likely been in someone else's ears before you. After use, they are often cleaned, repackaged, and handed out to the next unsuspecting passenger. Now let's talk about another item you might be inclined to use during your flight, the blankets and pillows. It might be comforting to think that these are freshly laundered for each flight, but that is far from the truth. More often than not, these items are merely folded and reused for multiple flights before they see the inside of a washing machine. Moving on to a slightly more serious topic, the emergency door handles. You might have noticed that these handles are placed in a way that would make it hard for a panicked passenger to open the door. That's because they are there to prevent flight attendants from being pushed out in the event of an emergency. Next, we venture into the realm of the unthinkable, bomb threats over the ocean. If a bomb threat occurs over an ocean, you, as a passenger, are likely not to hear about it. Why, you ask? Simply because there's nowhere to land a giant plane in the middle of an ocean. The crew would handle the situation without causing unnecessary panic among the passengers. Lastly, we have a fact about airplane toilets that might surprise you. These can actually be unlocked from the outside. 
there is usually a hidden latch or button on the outside of the door that can be used to unlock it. This is a safety feature in case someone becomes unwell or trapped in the toilet. But it's also a little unnerving to know that your privacy might not be as secure as you thought. It's shocking, isn't it? But there's more. We're just scratching the surface of the dirty secrets airlines don't want you to know. Buckle up because we're about to dive deeper. Did you know pilots are served different meals in case of food poisoning? Yes, it's true. This is done to ensure that if one meal is contaminated, both pilots won't fall ill at the same time, compromising the safety of the flight. It's a small precaution, but it's one that could potentially save hundreds of lives. Next up, let's talk about food service on night flights. Ever wonder why the cabin crew takes so long to serve meals on late night departures? It's not because they're slacking off. On the contrary, they're deliberately delaying the food service until more passengers fall asleep. This way, they can reduce the workload and also make the cabin quieter for those who want to rest. Moving on to a somewhat alarming fact. Pilots routinely nod off during long flights. Sounds scary, doesn't it? But don't worry, modern aircraft are equipped with advanced autopilot systems that can handle the majority of the flight. However, it's still a bit disconcerting to know that the person in control might be catching some Zs while cruising at 35,000 feet. Now, let's shift our focus to the tray table in front of you. Did you ever think that it could have been a changing table for a baby's diaper? Yes, it's not uncommon for parents to change their baby's diapers right there on the tray table. So, next time you're on a flight, you might want to think twice before laying out your snacks on that tray. Lastly, here's a shocking fact. Planes are frequently struck by lightning. But don't panic just yet. Aircraft are designed to withstand lightning strikes, and the electrical charge typically passes around the plane's exterior and out through the tail leaving the passengers and the onboard systems unharmed. You might be questioning your love for flying now, but hold on, we're not done yet. Flight attendants are using their cell phones during the flight. It's a common misconception that cell phone signals can interfere with aircraft systems. But here's an insider secret. It's not entirely about the signals. The real reason behind the no cell phone policy is to maintain order and safety. Imagine a cabin full of distracted passengers during an emergency situation. Chaos, right? But in a twist of irony, flight attendants sometimes use their cell phones during the flight. They are, after all, human beings who need to check in with their families, catch up on the news, or perhaps sneak in a quick game of Candy Crush. Now, let's talk about baggage. If your bag vibrates for any reason, you'll be called out to have it examined. It's not about embarrassment or invasion of privacy. It's a matter of safety. A vibrating bag could mean an electronic device left switched on, or worse, a potential threat. So, for the safety of everyone on board, make sure to turn off all your devices and secure your baggage properly. Lastly, have you ever wondered why the walkways are lit during a flight? It's not for ambience or aesthetics, it's for emergencies. In case of a sudden power outage or a smoke-filled cabin, the lit walkways guide passengers towards the exits. They are a critical part of the aircraft's safety measures, ensuring that even in the direst of circumstances, there is a path to safety. The world of air travel is filled with hidden truths and unspoken realities. From flight attendants sneaking in cell phone usage, to vibrating bags being a potential security concern, to the true purpose of those seemingly ambient, lit walkways. Now that you're armed with these truths, it's up to you. Continue to fly, or find another mode of transportation. So there you have it. The dirty facts about flying airlines don't want you to know. From the unsettling truth about underseat life jackets and onboard water quality, to the surprising realities of missing screws and unwashed blankets, we've uncovered some of the industry's best-kept secrets. Remember the different meals served to pilots, the unlockable toilets and the often unspoken occurrences during long-haul flights. Next time you're on a plane, remember these facts. Safe travels and until next time, stay curious.